Before most of us were even awake, a Minnesota family watches as their own Suni Lee wins Olympic gold. I'm so happy for her. Step cousin Faith Tao was there. I was like kind of like screaming and then talking to everybody else. By now the news has spread and state lawmakers are just as enthused. So when I saw the notification from ESPN this morning, I heard my wife's voice cheering, you know, yoohoo! So I knew right away that Sonessi Lee won. As the Hmong community celebrates, they reflect on what an accomplishment of this magnitude means. You know, her competition represents larger than just the uh, Olympic Games for the Hmong American community here in Minnesota. Uh, really represent us uh, really having a designation or you know even a, a country to call home. Fleeing war and persecution in Southeast Asia and now coming to the U.S. Uh, you know for myself as a politician, as an elected official, I represent Minnesota. Uh, you know, we uh, raise our hands to the Constitution, and I'm glad that Sunisa is representing our country, the USA, and Tokyo. State Senator Fong Her is already working on a resolution to honor her. And now our story is heard. We are the forgotten people of Southeast Asia who have helped America during the Vietnam War. Her story kind of symboli symbolized that. Her teammate, Simone Baus, you know, um, couldn't, couldn't continue anymore, and she saved the team. She saved the American team. Expect more celebrations when she returns. I'm so excited for you, and I'm so happy and so proud of you. Kaya Edwards, Carol Evan News.